My family has uh, witnessed many accidents at uh, the Four Corners and my husband, cousins, uh, different people have been there when accidents have happened and that's just been in the past couple years and we found that the accidents at Loon Lake were getting worse and our uh, status was rising as far as one of the most dangerous intersections. I believe it was October of 2021. Um, I got a call from WashDOT that they had found funding for compact roundabouts when we had been being told that there wasn't funding for a standard roundabout previously but now there was funding for 12 roundabouts in our state that were compact roundabouts and so we had made the list and it was a total surprise we were ecstatic and our community is so excited about having it these roundabouts reduce both the frequency and the severity of accidents, of multi-car accidents at the locations where we put them. While you're on 395, you may notice it slows down traffic because instead of going straight through like you used to, you do have to slow down to negotiate the roundabout. If someone going on 395 hits someone crossing into the roundabout, it reduces the severity of that. Instead of a 70 mile an hour and a 20 mile an hour T-bone accident, it's really more of a sliding accident because of the way that the roundabout directs traffic. This roundabout is going to improve our safety there. It is going to improve us being able to cross 395 in a manner that we all feel much more comfortable. When people leave my home, the last thing I say is be safe at four corners. You know, don't take any risks. And that's the last thing I always tell people. Now I'll feel much more comfortable with them uh, navigating that intersection. I think this is just going to be a very positive thing for our community in general.